Yo, what's up, y'all? It's Troy Brown, and I'm here. I'm about to bring you guys this player vlog. Just talking about being in the bubble, showing you guys different stuff. I'm gonna be trying to record everything and bring you different content from inside the bubble. Letting you guys know what's really going on. And then I'm just talking to y'all about real life things that are going on in the bubble. Recording live from the bubble. I got TV. It's raining super hard. We were trying to get in the cold tub. Man, it just started pouring out of nowhere. Like, man, it is crazy. I, I need it though. My legs hurt. Yeah, I'm about to get in this cold tub. I don't care what nobody talking about. They're not about to stop me from getting my recovery. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to let that be that. But I just wanted to check in with y'all. Yeah, I'm going to say, you going to feel this, How long are you guys usually sitting there for? 10 minutes. Update. Storm went away. Of course, after the storm goes away. Everybody else want to show up. After the storm goes away. It's still raining a little bit. I'm not going to lie, but my bag is soaked. I'm carrying it in a towel now. Literally carrying it in a towel. Because the bottom of the bag ripped. So um, hopefully I make it back to my room in one piece. Just trying to get some recovery here, man. That's all. Today is day 11. Day 11 of being in a bubble. So we're finally getting some time in here. You know, everybody's starting to settle in. Today we have an off day, so we're going to be running around. So I'm going to show you guys that. You need some help, big fella? You they say you need some help? Man, I'm a bodybuilder. Oh, my God. Here you go with this. I drink milk. <laughs> you putting this in the back? You just throw them in there like that? Yeah, dog. Slam the door. We get to ride. Bam. Morning there. Hey, good morning to you. How you be, girl? You ain't saying nothing but a word. They feeding us good here. The food is good. Great. It's great. We're blessed. I mean, I can't even get a good night's sleep because I'm eating all night. <laughs> they, had a, they, they got a Mickey Mouse ice cream. I felt like I was Mike Tyson. I bit the ear off of it <laughs> when I was eating. Good afternoon, everybody. My name is Dave Avery, equipment manager, assistant equipment manager for the Washington Wizards in the NBA. Today, we're going to bust some suds. Now, I have picked eight washers out of 66. I could use all 66 for individual loops, but I'm going to be nice and share the property. <laughs> if you never washed clothes before, this is the process. Normally, some people go down to the creek and get the, the dirty laundry and go and, and scrub it on the rocks and let it air dry in the tree. But we're going to use washing machines, OK? We're going to go down the line. And we're gonna go each one. Now we got it to the desired height. Now we're gonna bust some suds. Yo, so we just got back uh, from doing laundry with my guy Dave Avery, and um, I just got a quick story. I just wanted to tell everybody about my guy Dave. We playing in Madison Square Garden this year, and then I'm in warm ups. You know, I'm warming up, I'm shooting, and then, so Dave just come up to me and he's like, "Hey, yo, man, like I really feel like you gonna have a really good game today. Like I can just feel your energy. Like the energy in the building's good." He was like, "You, you gonna, you gonna do real good today," and then so I was like. Well, I'm not doing nothing like, you know, that I don't ever do. Like, I feel like I'm warming up, like everything's cool. And then so David's like, nah, like I could just see it in your face. Like you about to go kill it. And so I'm like, all right, well, I appreciate that. And then so I ended up having like 
27, like seven, like some like crazy game. And then so it was like one of those things where, you know, like it's good to have good people around you and like in your organization that believe in you and that like openly tell you that they believe in you and stuff. And so to have good dudes like that, like Dave is an unsung hero in our organization. Like he always making sure everybody's good, getting stuff taken care of. And so, you know, it's those type of people that, you know, keep you motivated and that keep you, you know, doing what you need to do. So I definitely wanted to just say shout out to my guy, Dave Avery, and thank you for letting me spend the day with you.